Tragedy has struck the policing community once again. An Ontario provincial police officer and a school bus driver are dead after a crash just before 7 a.m. this morning. This marks the sixth death of an on-duty Ontario police officer in the past year. The school bus was occupied by one male and the sedan was occupied by another male. The driver of the school bus was transported to Woodstock General Hospital where he was pronounced deceased and the driver of the sedan was pronounced deceased here at the scene. 35-year-old Detective Constable Stephen Turanjo has been identified as one of the victims of the crash that happened just northwest of Woodstock at the intersection of Highway 59 and Oxford County Road 33. Police say there were no students on the bus and no passengers in the officer's unmarked vehicle. Early indications are that the uh, sedan was traveling eastbound on Oxford Road 33 and uh, collided with the school bus which was traveling northbound. And at this point we have no cause as to who hit who first. Uh, it's early yet. The death comes less than three weeks after an OPP officer was fatally shot in an ambush style attack in eastern Ontario. Detective Consul Tronjo was, uh, was a well-respected uh, Ontario Provincial Police Officer and uh, he'll be greatly missed by, by his family and his colleagues. Um, it's going to leave a, a very uh, big hole in the hearts of everybody who knew him. OPP Commissioner Thomas Karik says he is deeply saddened over this tragic incident as two families mourn the loss of their loved ones. And there's been an outpouring of condolences from various police departments across Ontario. In a message posted to Twitter, Toronto Police Chief Myron Demkew offered his sincere and heartfelt condolences to all members of the Ontario Provincial Police and to the families, friends and communities impacted by these tragic deaths. The Toronto Police Association also extending their deepest condolences to the family and colleagues colleagues of Detective Constable Stephen Turanjo and the civilian who died earlier this morning. We're just devastated uh, once again. It's way too many. Um, one is too many. We just hope that uh, we don't have to do this uh, any more times. The identity of the school bus driver hasn't been released and little is known about what led to the crash. The OPP says the London Police Service has taken over the investigation. For City News, I'm Tine Azdani.